Just a random Batman gold label hanging out on an end cap with a little bit of everything. Uh, how about those Target stores, Target runs? Uh, luckily, we found this before, but uh, you never know what might be just uh, chilling on an end cap. And uh, let's start our Target run, Troy Hunt. What is going on? It's your guy, Kent Pool Collects. We are back at it. We're hanging out in the university area. Uh, been about a week since we've been to this Target store, so we're gonna see if there is anything new inside. If you haven't already, jump into Kent Pool Collects. We're having a lot of fun here on YouTube, also over on Instagram, Kent Pool Collects. Uh, if you're having trouble finding stuff in your area, check out Big Bad Toy Store. Link in the description. They got all kinds of stuff. Statues, hot toys, all kinds of diorama pieces, action figures. Check out Big Bad Toy Store. Link in the description. Let's get our target run started and uh, see what we can find today. Here we go. Uh, start off in our core car section or maybe a lack of car section. Got a few things going on. A little bit of tech deck. A lot of pegs though. Some transformers there. A little bit of matchbox. Monster jams. Monster trucks. Got a few tracks going on. A couple rigs. Some Mario Kart. So yeah, this area got quite a few things open, but uh, actually a decent amount of the Hot Wheels single releases. Quite a few on the pegs. Look at that, that's kind of cool. Little like Roadster here, nice. That's kind of cool. So yeah, definitely some different single releases to choose from. Got a few tracks, dinosaurs. A little bit of light here, some Pixar. Masters of the Universe. A little bit of Avatar, Squadrons, uh, looks like TIE Fighters, yep, TIE Fighters, Mission Fleet, there's another TIE Fighter, little, uh, little person in their mech suit, got some Black Series, uh, get this cart out of the way. A couple mission fleet ships as well. Got the Fat Man. Still got uh, Farouk. AEW. Little Macho Man. The Madness. But yeah, the wrestlers have definitely gotten scooped up. This whole section was just packed with wrestlers. There's our Sun Man, little Slave One. So that is why I come to this location because this is the newer Slave One. So you actually get uh, Django and Young Boba Fett. Now the question is, will they have the uh, troop transport, the uh, gunship for the Republic, because that is the other thing that uh, released. So we'll have to look around and see if we can find one of those. Uh, sometimes things are in different places at this location, but yep, that's new. Uh, Lando is not new though. <laughs> On this side. There's our Renew Your Vows. We've been seeing those kind of 
hitting more and more. Targets are restocking. Got Blue Marvel, Future Foundation, Spider-Man. Let's see. Blue Beetle, Booster Gold set, two pack. Black Adam, Dr. Fate. So we got some of our Black Adam movie. There's Owlman, Joker, Adam Smasher, Pink Ranger, Ninja, Red Ninja, some different Buzzworthy, a lot of basic Transformers and our little set there. All right, I'm gonna look around and see what else we can find at uh, this Target. Oh, I missed Ocean Master. Here's we got uh, a little bit of Pokemon going on. Some different sets and creatures, characters. Piggy. Ooh, look at this guy. First time, I think first time. Is this a restock, maybe? Ray, interesting. But uh, I don't know, if we haven't seen this guy before, uh, haven't seen him in a long time. There's Amy, and that is Ray. I guess that's not Sonic. <laughs> uh, I guess I gotta work on my Sonic lore, but uh, Maybe this is a new wave of Sonic characters. We got Mighty there. Tails. A little bit of Mario going on. A couple Mario characters. A few Mario levels. Sonic 3-pack. Statues from Star Wars. A little bit of Fortnite. It's another Mario level. Uh, we'll go see. I feel like the collector's area gets smaller and smaller, but we'll go see what's left of it at this Target. Collector's spot. We got uh, some 8-bit <laughs> Stranger Things. I don't know if maybe somebody just found those somewhere in the back. Dinosaurs, Kenobi, more dinosaurs. Kenobi, Vader, Marvel, got some Stranger Things, couple three and three quarter inch, Super 7, got some movie monsters, so here is your Wolfman, all uh, in living color, some accessories with that, Puppet Master, Definitely uh, scary little creatures, characters. That's kind of cool with uh, the Toonie Terrors. Still got our poor Warhammer. Nobody's scooping him up. Got a red ninja, a little halo there. So I think that's going to do it for this Target run. Hey run and we are done no pickups uh new sonic figures new squadron with uh the slave one from the prequels uh you got your uh Django and young boba fett in that pack uh those sonic characters whether you're collecting rings or taking on the old eggman definitely uh, find you some video games. I'm sure they make for awesome uh, displays kind of putting together those levels and stuff so that is uh, pretty cool to see some Sonic characters. Again you can let me know in the comments. I think they're new either that or they're like restocks again Target <laughs> they find stuff like in the back all the time so maybe they came out a long time ago and finally put them out sometimes it is hard keeping track uh we saw some marvel legends a little bit of uh, mcfarland tons of dinosaurs 
Hot Wheels, but the rest of the car aisle looking a little on the empty side. And uh, our poor collector spot gets uh, smaller and smaller, I think, every time we come into this store. But I got an awesome deal on a two pack from Amazon, a little Marvel Legends. So we're going to get back to the toy room, show you that box because I know y'all love the new Hasbro boxes and then uh, we're gonna get some figures out and take a look at them and uh, yeah it's a, it's a two-pack it's Marvel Legends let's get back to the toy room YouTube we are back in the toy room and we got a great deal on Amazon little Marvel Legends two-pack uh, I think it was like at least $18 off this set. So I decided to uh, pick it up. If only I can uh, cut open the box, huh? Cut open the label. I'm doing it just a little awkward. A little awkward here. There we go. Ooh, got it. All right. Now give that a little cut there it's okay because it's in a box Nothing, nothing's gonna get damaged it's in a box we got king in black two pack featuring marvels Noel, phantom so yeah uh, this was one of those things where I kind of waited to pick it up. I've seen it a few places out and about uh, some different comic book shops and stuff. But when I saw Amazon had it on sale, decided to pull the trigger. Got our 60 years of Spider-Man on there too. Hopefully two figures in the box, right? No Venom. Uh, this came straight from Amazon. So I'm pretty sure we'll get what we're looking for in the box. We'll just have to see if there's any issues paint-wise with the figures. But uh, you get the figures... Noel coming with two head sculpts and the Necro Sword. You got Venom. He's got those big old wings. I'm interested to see how those work out. Looks like open hands, closed fists, open mouth, tongue out, and closed mouth. So let's get this guy open and uh, see what comes out of the box, right? So we just opened one box and now we're getting ready to open our second box. I always uh, forget like down on these corners. Gotta tape it up. We don't want anybody getting into the boxes and switching it out. I don't want uh, something crazy inside this. I want, uh, the figures that are on the box, which uh, I'll say for these boxes, uh, you know, like the different artwork and stuff definitely looks nice. Like you can see the little blue of like Venom and Null in the background and then the characters. So, you know, definitely doing some cool stuff. I almost, almost tossed the box. Look at that. We had one more thing. Make sure your boxes are empty so you're not uh, calling Hasbro and complaining about uh, <laughs> not finding everything. But I imagine those are our wings. And it does, in fact, look like we got two figures. I imagine this is probably hands or a head sculpt. Gonna release the venom. Release him. All right, pretty heavy venom. Venom's got some weight to him. Uh, Noel is uh, man looking. 
He is a little bigger than uh, I was expecting. But let's go ahead. It's like Christmas, right? Christmas time. Yeah, I am actually uh, impressed with Noel. I was not uh, expecting him to be so massive. He is pretty good size. Uh, we'll pull in our poor Iron Man here that was uh, just kind of chilling. He didn't know he was even going to be part of this video. So our normal 6-inch Marvel Legend sized up with Noel. And as long as we got him there, we might as well uh, take out that Venom. So yeah, I think Noel's actually taller than Venom. The symbiote. His uh, legs don't wanna, there we go. So yeah, that's pretty cool. Those, uh, those look pretty good. We'll take Iron Man out. Thanks Iron Man for a little size. Let you know how they look. So, yeah, I guess that makes sense. Uh, you know, definitely a lot of plastic with both of these figures. Here, let's pull that in just a little bit. Yeah, look at all that goodness. Uh, the Knoll head sculpt. Yeah, that's pretty uh, wicked, big old smile. Uh, it's one of those, like, do they have more in common than we think all right so yeah big old wings look at that gonna have to play around with those a little bit but i do like you got some articulation there so you can definitely play around the black but they did uh kind of bring in the red to kind of look, you know, another layer and make it a uh, very wing, more creature-like, bat-like than uh, just being like, look at this big old symbiote blob of, um, of wing. So yeah, I'll play around with those and we'll attach that to Venom. As Venom takes out Noel, because that's all it takes. I tell you what, plastic, like, some days none of this stuff wants to move. And then there's other times where just barely sneeze and everything comes crashing down. Alright, so this looks like probably our Venom bag. Even though uh, the like tongue head sculpt and everything is pretty wild, pretty crazy. There is the closed fist. Closed fist action. And there is the closed mouth. So again, like these two, look at that. Big old smiles, big old cheese. Cheese in it. Just like when they used to lock cheese in the dumpster. So I like uh, I like the red on Noel too, and you know all the mythic legions and stuff we've been getting this year. The uh, the pauldrons look good on Noel. Here's that alternate head sculpt, just kind of frowny frowny face. Like don't. Uh, don't ruin my evil plans. I don't know, as uh, massive as this Knoll head sculpt is, I might even try that on uh, some of our mythic legions. He's, uh, he's almost got that vampire uh, brood look to him. And of course, we can't forget the Necro Sword. This was uh, also in Thor Love and Thunder. 
And yeah, this came out pretty good. There's like just a slight bend in the middle, but uh, you know, nothing not nothing that can't be fixed or rearranged. Yeah, this is cool. Definitely uh, digging this pack. I don't know that I would have, you know, got it like any sooner. Because, again, I thought uh, Amazon knocking off $18 made it, uh, you know, made it work for me and uh, what I wanted. So, pretty cool. Let me uh, play around with the wings. We'll try to uh, change a few things up. And uh, we'll kind of come back with our final thoughts. Alright, so I decided to uh, stay with the head sculpts that came in the package, uh, threw on the fist, kept the open hand, <laughs> the wings, the, the wings are going to take some getting used to, they're so massive, um, but I think the figure, you know, you can kind of balance him out and stuff and play around with some different uh, poses. But, man, they are some massive wings. <laughs> uh, just trying to fit them into pictures, fit them into the video. But uh, it's cool. It's uh, not necessarily a problem because uh, I think they, uh, they make it worth it. This uh, Venom, a little different than uh, the rest of the Venoms we've gotten in the past. But uh, pretty cool design. Uh, again, no lot uh, massive, bigger than I had uh, originally thought for him. So that is cool. We got the uh, Necro Sword there and a little bit of a face off between the two characters. But uh, let me know in the comments, have you scooped up this two-pack? Did you get uh, the deal on Amazon? What kind of deals do you think we will get with the holidays coming up? Uh, maybe even a bigger, better deal on Amazon. Uh, Best Buy, Target. There are definitely some retailers out there that uh, should be having this set. And, uh, you know, will it be November, December into the new year where you might get a pretty good deal on this set? Or were you happy just uh, scooping this up and getting it into your collection wherever uh, you found it at uh, the different stores or online? But uh, hopefully you enjoyed this video. Smash that like button, comment, and share if you haven't already. Jump into Kent Pool Collects. We're having a lot of fun here on YouTube. Also over on Instagram, Kent Pool Collects. Uh, I'll have to double check, but uh, I think you could probably find this set on Big Bad Toy Store. I know they have a lot of Marvel Legends. And uh, the funny thing about Big Bad Toy Store is uh, out of nowhere, <laughs> they'll have like exclusives of uh, stuff that uh, you thought would only be at other stores. So uh, check out Big Bad Toy Store, Marvel Legends, all kinds of good stuff on their website. Link in the description, Big Bad Toy Store, if you want to just help out the channel go uh, click on that link. You don't even have to buy anything. Just uh, go take a look, see what they got at uh, Big Bad Toy Store. Thank you to all of our subscribers. Uh, always enjoy reading the comments and uh, thank you for the likes and the shares and for uh, jumping in and being part of this Thank you to our channel members. Your support is so appreciated. And until next time, always be hunting, have fun collecting.